गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल टुडे कैरेट फर्टिलाइजर मैनेजमेंट पार्ट टू हाउ टू चेक न्यूट्रिय लेवल्स इन योर सॉइल वेल द जनरल रूल इज दैट द कैरेट फर्टिलाइजर्स आई एम गोइंग टू मैंशन बिलो आर द बेस्ट इट इज़ गुड टू चेक द सॉइल फॉर न्यूट्रिय बिफोर फर्टिलाइजिंग कैरेट्स एन पी के कैन बी अप्लाइड थर्टी डेज आफ्टर जनरेशन uh symptoms of nutrition deficiency include uh, yellow or purple leaves that uh, die early and the plants become uh, the the macronutrients are uh, responsible for plant growth uh including root and uh, leaf formation and uh, photosynthesis uh you just follow the fertilizer instruction to apply the right dosage Mm, too much nitrogen leaves in in the soil can result uh, in cracked carrots and too much leaf production can damage uh, carrot uh, formation uh, excessive formation with uh, phosphorus can cause water pollution uh, the npk fertilizer removes all three nutrients and uh, Uh, make it uh, suitable for carrot growth uh, this fertilizer can be used in in the soil uh, 30 days after uh, germination uh, locally we we have a product uh, it's called uh, standard mixer number 4 uh, this that, that is suitable for our uh, nilgiri and uh, uh, throughout the nilgiri uh, carrots uh carrots are a root plant and uh, too much nitrogen can promote leaf growth and uh, make uh, carrot hairy uh, hairy and uh, cracked uh but uh, be careful uh, do not use much phosphorus uh, as it can cause water pollution so before planting carrots uh, make sure that your soil has uh, all the nutrients needed for proper uh, plant growth uh, if there is any deficiency uh, add a uh, fertilizer or uh, avoiding uh, avoid uh, adding too much fertilizer to carrot plants uh, as it uh, it can spoil the taste of uh, carrots uh, remember uh, to water your plants properly after uh, fertilizing uh, essential nutrition for gro- uh, carrot growth uh, it's uh, nitrogen uh, n nitrogen uh, carrots have a relatively low nitrogen requirement uh a good yield is uh, possible with at least uh, 80 kg uh, per hectare uh, however up uh, up to 130 kg nitrogen can be used in your uh, soil especially in uh, soils with high phosphorus and potassium levels and uh, in sandy soils with uh, excessive uh, leakage uh, high nitrogen rate should uh, should be avoided as it uh, stimulates uh, leaf growth at the expense of uh, root growth and yield and delay pruning uh, in general it, it is better to reduce nitrogen than to use more uh, the growth of very green leaves can also promote the development of diseases uh, such as uh, sclerot- sclerotinia uh, it's called white mold uh, especially in dense plants uh nitrogen is uh, mainly used in, in planting except for uh, sandy soil soil types where leaching is possible the rest is uh, used to, uh, usually in 4 uh, to 8 weeks uh, when the leaves begin to grow rapidly uh, due to the high potassium requirement of uh, of the of your crop uh, uh, potassium nitrate is uh, often preferred for the uh, for the top dressing uh nitrogen deficiency uh, it helps nitrogen uh, crop growth and root color due to uh, keratin synthesis lack of nitrogen causes uh, uh, stunted growth and uh, discoloration of leaves uh, nitrogen deficiency can be caused by uh, drought uh, low organic matter and uh, planting in soil with uh, high or low ph levels Uh, next is uh, phosphorus phosphorus promotes uh, root growth and uh, stronger uh, growth uh, it is a sufficient uh, factor for all weeds uh, where the soil has a, a high level of phosphorus uh, 40 kg of phosphorus per hectare should be a sufficient for a good uh, uh, good uh, carrot crops uh, Uh, other secondary factors are energy energy storage and uh, and the storage of nucleic acid 
several factors cause phosphorus deficiency uh, planting carrots in iron rich soils uh, planting in humid condition and uh, low organic matter that symptoms of uh, this deficiency uh, it is stunt and uh, growth is stunt some roots uh, uh, it's not developing fully actually uh, phosphorus is an uh, uh, root development uh, element uh, so we need a right time to give uh, uh, phosphorus dap or single super phosphate at the initial stage of the planting uh, if the soil have enough uh, phosphate content uh, sometimes uh, it uh, can't connect uh, connect through the plant or uh, our roots or uh, foliar sprays uh, like this kind of problem uh, i strongly recommended to you use a uh, uh, bone meal uh, it uh, it is a uh, highly rich uh, phosphorus content um, it uh, uh, bone meal have a, a good ph phosphorus source uh, to the crops uh, so if if your soil highly hardened or uh, some tough conditions of soil uh, should definitely use uh, bone meal for supplying uh, phosphorus to the plant the high potassium required for this uh, crop can sometimes uh, lead to magnesium deficiency which can be uh, corrected with a spray of magnesium sulfate uh, see Uh, sulfur is uh, essential because it helps uh, use nitrogen and uh, formation of chlorophyll uh, the best way to report sulfur deficiency is uh, research the leaves uh, if they are uh, faint or uh, the same green color you need to put uh, sulfur in your soil uh, sulfur deficiency occurs mainly in acidic uh, and sandy soil and low organic matter soil uh, the sulfur uh, definitely uh, required then calcium deficiency uh, calcium has many benefits and uh, one of them is that uh, it makes uh, uh, carrot resistant to biological and uh, abiotic stresses uh, other benefits including regular regulating the enzyme enzyme system and uh, enhancing the structural uh, stability of cells and um, membranes uh, if the root is small you need to add more calcium to your soil so that's it uh, for major uh, we seen macronutrients and uh, some micronutrients for carrots uh, i hope uh, all are you enjoying this video uh, definitely it should be a uh, useful for uh, carrot growers Uh, if any uh, requirements or uh, if any uh, deficiency symptoms uh, in that in your field uh, and sometimes you can't uh, identify which deficiency in which time it, it can occur to your plants so such a difficult task to uh, some some kind of uh, farmers so overall farmers they know because they have a lot of uh, practice in that crop Uh, they know what to do and what time we have to give fertilizer and uh, what time we have to dry, uh, irrigate the irrigation uh, and all uh, spraying these things uh, so it it is uh, e very easy to cultivate uh, uh, here in nil greece if, if you have any doubts or uh, any problem you just call me uh, whenever whatever time you want uh definitely i'll help you uh, so please uh, share this video to your friends and uh, your, um, your farming friends uh, and your family uh, don't forget to like uh, and subscribe our channel uh, support us thanks for watching uh, udaykumar